We had hamsters and one guinea pig. So we didn't go for the rabbits, what with living in London. But we were always fans of <laughs> small furry creatures. <laughs> So I'm joined by Daisy Ridley and Elizabeth Debicki. Hello. Hello. Um, hi. So you are the younger sisters of Peter Rabbit in the film. Mm. Peter Rabbit. Mm. Can you tell us about your characters? Um, Cottontail's a little live wire. She uh, she's really just sort of doing her own thing. There are bits that I wish there was one bit that I really wanted people to notice that I didn't when she jumps up and then comes walking. Into I frame. love that. Mm. Where's that? Um, in it's the when montage. We're training. Oh right. Yeah. Watch it again. It's it's a great moment, and she's just constantly sort of doing the unexpected. She's awesome. And what about yourself? Well, Mopsy's very sensible in comparison. <laughs> she's the oldest one, right? She's the eldest, yeah. Oldest. So they say. She deeply believes she's the <laughs> eldest. It's very important to her that that's true. Um, I think that she's sort of more the mum, I suppose, and and she wants to keep everybody sort of in line and together, and she likes to sort of wield some power. Hierarchy is very important to her. Mm. Do you, did you model it on, on rabbits that you had as a kid? Did you like rabbits before you started this film? Who doesn't I, like rabbits? Well, Mr. McGregor. No, that's true. Right. Yeah. But that's he's, true. he's a monster. My godmother has always had rabbits, and she came to see this, and she was really genuinely moved because she said the rabbits are so rabbity. The sort of mannerisms of the rabbits have really been researched. Oh, right. Is the apology thing real then when they put their Yes, together? that's real. Oh, okay. So she found that very moving. We had hamsters and one guinea pig. So we didn't go for the rabbits, what with living in London. But we were always fans of <laughs> small furry creatures. Why were you not allowed rabbits living in London? Oh, because as in we live on a street with no garden. Oh, right. So a hamster's like loving life. The world is its oyster. Sure, yeah, yeah. Rabbit, they move cr around quite a lot. Elizabeth, did you have rabbits as a kid? No. No. I had a dog. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, actually, then we had a dog. <laughs> Guess we could have had a rabbit. <laughs> so no rabbits in the family at all. Not, no frame of reference. You just went for it. You did your best rabbit impression. Just went for it. it. Yeah. Just went for it. Yeah. 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 And you know, Animal Logic are amazing animators. So mm. I had faith that they were gonna they were gonna bring their best bunny. Yeah. Had you like table. read any Beatrix Potter before? Did you? Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, I think we fans. both grew up on it mm. and and were read it as children and. Yeah. Which, which like stories in particular? Was it Peter Rabbit or was it Peter Tiggy Rabbit? Winkle? Peter, Peter Rabbit and Tiggy Winkle. You're a Jemima, Jemima Puddle Duck. I'm a Mrs. Tiggy Winkle. Okay. Have you been to Beatrix Potterworld? Yes, many times. You have. We used to go and do a violin course in the Lake District right. every year in the summer. Every time. It's amazing. I guess you've never been. I've never been. And I've and I've wanted to go back. I've been meaning to go back. I haven't had time. But I um I really want to go back. You should go. I mean, they would love you there. They'd be they'd, your picture would be everywhere, surely. And you could just pose oh, next to the rabbits. It's, no, it's not about that. It's just a great place. It's, it's a really great, lovely, great isn't place. It? It's beautiful. Mm. I want to see a picture of little you with a violin and Beatrix Potterworld. There's a picture. I was once on the brochure of the violin thing I used to do. But like me and my sisters, we used to look very grumpy when we were on the violin. So it's <laughs> me like that. <laughs> it's quite cute though. I wonder if there's any pictures of Beatrix Potterworld. Probably. I, I would hope so. Get yeah. out of the press tour of this. Brilliant. Uh, so what's your favourite bit of the film? What bit should we look out for? <sighs> um, a bit where Peter Rabbit pokes someone's eye is so unexpected. Oh, what yeah, you've that, never seen. Yeah. And really made me laugh. Made me and everyone around me laugh a lot. I, I love so many of the supporting characters in this as well. Yeah. The pig is my... Perhaps one Love of my faves. Pig. He's he's unexpectedly brilliant. Yeah, he is. And I just feel that scene stealer. Parents will will appreciate the mm. addition of the pig. Mm. Yeah. Excellent. Well, thank you so much, guys. That's thank, you. thank you.